Tonight, could Michael Cohen be sending a message to President Trump? Trump's longtime personal attorney retweeted a photo uh, with comedian that Tom Arnold that he had posted of the two of them together last night. Arnold told NBC News, quote, it's on. I hope he, Trump, sees the picture of me and Michael Cohen and it haunts his dreams. And he said, this dude has all the tapes. This dude has everything. Tom Arnold is out front. He is working on a new show for Viceland called The Hunt for the Trump tapes. That is true. Thank you for being here this evening. I have a lot oh to get gosh. to. Okay, so let's, let's jump in. Let's jump in. I appreciate you being here. So we know, we know that Michael Cohen is facing a criminal investigation here in New York. I should point out no charges no have been charges filed yet. But despite none. the mounting pressure, yes. he's meeting with you here in New York. He's not taking reporter questions. Oh. Um, did, did he tell you that he has something incriminating on President Trump. Well, let me just say one thing about uh, Michael Cohen. First of all, he's talked about how, how kind and appropriate the FBI was when they came to his place. You know, and Donald Trump talks about him. That's in stark contrast yes, to what the president stark contrast. Has said. The president's trying to, to say the FBI are all these criminals, and, and it's just not true. The FBI was completely appropriate. Michael Cohen said they knocked on his door and were so nice to him. So to be clear, That's Michael, line number one. On. To be clear, Michael Cohen has zero problem with the FBI. FBI. He has no problem with the FBI. That's okay. a fact. They were kind to him when they knocked on his door okay. and took his stuff. So let's get to this question I just asked. Number Did two. Michael Cohen tell you he has something incriminating on President Trump? How yes, could he yes not have no. any? First of all, I knew that I know. Well, yes, appreciate Tom, Ar Tom Arnold's kind words about me as a great father, husband, and friend. That was a chance, he's referring to the photograph um, that you tweeted, that mm -hmm. was a chance public encounter in the hotel lobby. Where he, where he asked for a selfie. Mm -hmm. By the way, that's the way it looked to me when I saw it. Right. So hold on. Then he goes on and says, not spending the weekend together, did not discuss <laughs> being on his show, nor did we discuss POTUS. But what is it you want me to say? Oh, I just want to know the answer. I want to know if Michael Cohen said to you, Tom, I have something incriminating on the president. No, he didn't say those okay. words. Did he play any of the tapes he has for you? <laughs> Uh, did he play any of the tapes? Uh, did he play any tapes for me? No. Okay. Um, Jeez. Earlier today, you apologized for telling NBC News that Cohen was working with you to take down. No, I apologize for Trump. saying. Right, 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 right. For saying yeah. that Cohen was working with you to take down the president. Can you just set the record straight for us? Yes. Well, I mean, he is working. <laughs> I mean, he's working with America. He's to take down the president. To take take down those are my words. Oh my God, my glasses. To take down those are my words. Those are Tom Arnold uh, words that I said. And you are a self-proclaimed crazy person. Yes. So when you, did those meetings happen? When exactly? Like roughly. Well, there was the one with Don Jr. at Trump Tower, and uh, when was that? Paul Manafort. No, I'm just making no, up crap. Come on. I'm just, oh my God. I'm asking no, you. I don't know uh, when they had. You know, ask Michael. He he reminded me of it. Have you been meeting with Michael Cohen? Uh, be, be, because uh, I can't. Tell, I don't. I'm not sure of the context of the other, the other meetings. And I swear, I know I sound like Jeff Sessions, but uh, but but uh, say hello right, to last night was about eyeball, you know, to say, I didn't know if it, how, what was going to go down. I don't know if we were going to fight because I know that, and it turned out to be a good thing. I'm going to go back to the Regency with Michael Did Cohen. Well, I want you to listen for a second. Just look, just take, consider this. And I, I'm going to spend the weekend with Michael Cohen. And the president, and Donald Trump, Ivanka Trump, I'm spending the weekend hanging out with Michael Cohen. And there's a lot going on. Did, so did, let, and, uh, you've treated it, you've disrespected him and his family, and there's a lot going on. So Tom, he, appreciate Tom, Ar Tom Arnold's kind words about me as a great father, husband, and friend. That was a chance, he's referring to the photograph um, that you tweeted, that okay. was a chance public encounter in the hotel lobby where he, where he asked for a selfie. Mm -hmm. By the way, that's the way it looked to me when I saw it. Right. So hold on. Then he goes on and says, not spending the weekend together, did not discuss <laughs> being on his show, nor did we discuss POTUS. Did Michael Cohen tell you specifically, really just yes or no, that he is cooperating with the authorities should charges be brought? Did he tell you?
Do you not want to answer the question? No. You don't want to answer the question? Right. Okay. Thank because... You. Will you let us know what you learn over the weekend since you're spending the weekend no. with Michael Cohen? No. He is getting paid yeah. by Viceland to do a series about what he calls the Trump tapes, in which Tom Arnold will try to get his hands on and play for us previously unheard tape of Donald Trump from Donald Trump's TV show and a variety of other possible sources, possibly including Michael Cohen's tapes of Donald Trump. And the best way to do it is one word answers. Yes or no? Oh, boy. that's the best way That's to do it. That's true. Okay, so let me let me get my oh my gosh, let me get my prosecutor pen. Okay, so do you have tape of Donald Trump using the N word on the set of Celebrity Apprentice? No. Is Michael Cohen going to tell the truth to the FBI and the prosecutors when they question him? Yes. And you are a self-proclaimed crazy person. Yes. So you've said that you, on TV, you have said you've spent some time with him and you're going to spend the whole weekend with him. Right. Okay. He then tweets, so, uh, appreciate Tom, Ar Tom Arnold's kind words about me as a great father, husband and friend. That was a chance, he's referring to the photograph um, that you tweeted, that okay. was a chance public encounter in the hotel lobby. Where he, where he asked for a selfie. Mm -hmm. By the way, that's the way it looked to me when I saw it. Right. So hold on. Then he goes on and says, not spending the weekend together, did not discuss <laughs> being on his show, nor did we discuss POTUS. And you are a self-proclaimed crazy person. Yes, so get right. the, well, let's get been, the romance. It's been ongoing. Let's get the bromance oh, clarified yeah, right yeah, away. Let's are do you it. spending the weekend together? Yeah. You are? Yeah. Why would he say you're not? Well, I don't know. You know, it's been back and forth that he said you need to make this clear. And there's been a lot of tweeting and a lot of and I tried to make it clear. You're a great father. You're you're great. You did. I didn't say this. I said this. And the truth is, that he this wouldn't be happening. If it wasn't for him. Is the real truth. And I tried to go, OK, well, this is what you this is. I'm trying to have his back like every okay. possible okay. way. So We have a long conversation. Brian takes a picture of us. It wasn't a mm -hmm. selfie. Michael Cohen is an episode of our show. I will tell you that right now. We are filming an episode about Michael Cohen. And, but, he, but, Michael he, Cohen's, this but, whole... but he says he's not cooperating with your show. <laughs> so he's the star of the episode of this show. He keeps tweeting and, and, uh, and we have, I, 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 I don't know what to say. In the right side, does that include the FBI and the yes. prosecutors? Yes. So he's cooperating with them already? Yes. Okay. A hundred percent. And how do you know that? He told you that? He didn't say those words, but I words know that. Said? What were the words he said? I know that, people are... That indicate bit... that. No, that's okay. I can understand. Um, You've spoken to prosecutors. Well, I have. I've spoken to prosecutors about anything that uh, involves Michael Cohen or Donald Trump or any of, any of that stuff. Let me ask you a question. If you had, would you talk about it on this show? I give you. Let me just say this. There's a unique situation that I have that uh, that that has to do with. Uh, uh, you are a self-proclaimed crazy person. Yes. So By the way, I missed my kids' uh, Jackson's fit, uh, kindergarten mm -hmm. uh, graduation to be here. I'm the one that you know is missing out. He I, talks about his kids. What about Tom Arnold? Uh, listen, I love having you here, but I'm yeah. not sure I approve of you missing that kindergarten graduation. Nobody's watching this, right? No, so, uh, it's it's actually.